Major road closure in North Colorado Springs just started today. The affected area is Voyager Parkway at the on and off ramps to the new North Powers Boulevard extension to I-25. Drivers are asked to use Spectrum Loop as a detour around the construction. Cardio 13 Scott Harrison is live at the construction site right now, which will be there for nearly a year. Scott. That's right, Heather. When this $18.5 million project is finished next fall, it's going to have an overpass behind me here on this stretch of Voyager. We'll step out of the way and show you the area we're talking about. That's what closed as of this morning. And going under the overpass here will be traffic from the eventual extension of powers between here and Highway 83. Officials also want to finish the project in time for the opening of the Sunset Amphitheater next fall. Depending on your viewpoint, Denny Squibb chose either a good time or a bad time to move from Grand Junction to the Northgate area of Colorado Springs. Construction on the new Sunset Amphitheater is in progress, and now part of the Voyager Parkway connection to I-25 will be closed for nearly a year. It's sending more traffic and noise along Spectrum Loop, the detour around the project where Denny takes his daily walk. I didn't realize it was going to be closed for a year, but uh, it is what it is, and uh, it'll be better for people in the long run, I'm sure. Workers will build an overpass on Voyager to prepare for the next phase of extending North Powers Boulevard from where it ends at Highway 83. The Copper Ridge Metro District is paying for the project with property tax revenue from the surrounding commercial and retail businesses. Uh, by doing the financing, we can get the project going immediately versus if we had to wait for PPRTA funds, it would be many years off. That agency, the Pikes Peak Rural Transportation Authority, will reimburse the Metro District for the project's cost. And doing it this way means that the project will be ready when the last phase of the Powers Extension starts in 2025. The Metro District also financed the new connection of North Powers from Voyager to I-25, including the construction of several bridges. And officials tonight are recommending that drivers and pedestrians coming through this area think about taking other routes besides the recommended route on Spectrum Loop. And they really want you to do that to avoid just more congestion in this area, particularly during the morning and evening rush hour periods. We're live in North Colorado Springs. Scott Harrison, KRDO 13.